All right, welcome to the final Tinkercad assignment, and then we'll be learning a new CAD program. So this is called Winter Wonderland. Um, start off, you insert four cones onto the platform. So it doesn't matter whether you just actually click in four, or you, you know, copy and paste them from here. That's totally up to you. Um, whatever works really best for you is fine. Okay. Um, make one cone 50 by 50, make another 40 by 40, uh, make another 30 by 30, and then the other one, it says make the other one 20 by 20, which means you don't really have to do anything because they're naturally 20 by 20. Okay, so that's 50 by 50. This is 40 by 40. And then we have, gotta zoom out a little bit, maybe move something over. Uh, 30 by 30, and then the other one's 20 by 20, so nice. Okay, so that's what it should look like, good. Uh, lift the cones up at intervals of 12. So the widest one we'll keep at zero, and then the next one 12, the third one 24, the fourth one 36. So and you, you could really, this is where you, instead of using, you can just lift it up a little bit and just write the number there, because that's going to be a lot easier. So press the black triangle, and then here this would be 36. Good. So now they're raised a little bit. Place them one on top of another perfectly centered. This is where you should definitely be using the align tool. So what you can do is if you highlight everything and press align, then the two middle ones here, and now you have them all perfectly aligned. All right, uh, paint them green. Looks like a tree now. Make sure they're perfectly centered. Like I said, group them all together. So it should be grouped. Very nice. Make the height of the whole tree 60. So the height here, 60. Um, copy and paste the tree, making another identical one, but make that height 70. Okay, so now we just change the height over here to 70. Do that twice to make four trees in a row that are 60, 70, 60, 70. Okay, so I'm just gonna place them where I know they need to be to start. I'm going to copy paste, and then I'm going to take that and move them over. All right, I'm, uh, I like making sure that they're where they need to be, so I'm going to just be particular about it. All right, so far that should be okay. As you see when I'm moving it with the arrows on my keypad, you, the square surrounding it really tells you how you're doing as far as how much room you have on the plate. Okay, so we have our trees. Insert a box. Make the length and width 65 by 65. Okay, so at this point we're done with the trees, so now you can kind of look at it like this. So this is going to be 65 by 65. Uh, make a height of 65. Yeah, right here. So that's the height. So 65. It's good. Then it says make sure the box is at the corner. So I'm really just going to do my best to get it as close to that corner as possible. I think that's okay. Yeah, that looks okay. Um, add a roof. So there's actually a thing just called roof. So that's convenient for us fit the roof to the top of the box, so 65 by 65. Well, let's see if we have to change the height of anything. Okay, and then it says, make the height of the roof 20. I think it starts off as 10, it does. Good, and I will see you all next video.